Okay, everybody, welcome. And this will be kind of a special video. I'll be doing these videos when I want to, you know, tell you something important or interesting about the Dota 2 and, you know, some feelings that I have about the game. And this one kind of struck me yesterday. I was playing and we had a terrible pick, okay? Imagine the worst pick, like let's say four to five off laners. Like we have five heroes, possible hard laning. So I was like, or sorry, four, because I was not picking it because I was a smart person in the team. Um, so I was like, okay, what lanes are we running though? I was like, I wanted to see what lanes are we running. Okay, so right now I'm on this team. Okay, there's a picks. I have no idea what the lanes are. Okay, so what I would have to do is who is mid? That's the first one. So I'm, I, I, for example, it's gonna be Zeus. So Zeus would be mid. I'd be like, okay, so Zeus is on the mid. Then who's on the bottom? So I'd be like, who is bottom? And there would be. Probably somebody, let's say the Kanka with the Earthshaker is going to say that. So, okay, I know they are there. So, I know Razor is going to be top. So, I'm going to pick some supports for him. Or, I'm going to pick Jungle. That I know. <laughs> After, like, two questions that possibly, by the way, on Europe servers are not going to be answered. Mostly, they are not going to be answered. Or, they're not going to be answered with some uh, cursing in different language toward my little person, okay, in the game. Because I feel very little when I'm so frustrated. Um... So that's the problem. I just cannot click back to the game. I just don't have any option. Like what I can do, enter doesn't work. Nothing works. I cannot get. I cannot see the game. And that's my problem. That's the video about because in Dota One, if you remember, I just don't know the lanes. And if I'm gonna be ignored, I'm picking sometimes blindly. Because if I'm gonna pick something, right now I just cannot go into the game yet. So I need to pick. I need to pick specifically. Hero cannot repick anything. This function doesn't work, you need to be on that screen. So right now, I right now after the pick, I see the lanes. Okay, this is what happens. Did I pick right? I don't know. On the Publix, I think it's an issue. Yesterday, it really struck me, when we had like bad pick, that this is pretty bad. Like, I was like, why it's not even in the game? Because in Dota 1, which I'm gonna show, sorry, Dota 1 or Warcraft 3, the picking stage has been done in this setting, okay, so there's your heroes, you can pick from these and you are in the game, so you are picking in the game itself, so right now you know, if my team is gonna pick, for example, there's gonna be the terrible pick but they're gonna choose their lanes, okay, one guy is gonna buy wards and let's say he's running with the wards on the top, I immediately know that, for example, he's gonna be alone on the top, so that I know somebody's gonna be mid, I know that the guy is on the mid, so I can immediately know, okay after their picks, after they are going to be choosing lanes, where they are going, what I'm supposed to pick, what I'm supposed to pick, okay, re in regard to what they are going. I think it's very important on the public, because communication is sometimes not an option. There's just none of it, okay. And right now, if I can see the heroes, if I can see everything moving, I can adjust my pick to it, okay. So that is it. <laughs> I would like to be able to switch to this, to the game part, and see where are we going with this okay because i just can't ask the person like almost everybody where are they going and what role they are be taking okay if it's bad pick at least let's lane this the most correct way that we can okay or the best way that we can but i need to see this i cannot ask them because there's not many answers in Dota 2 these days okay and that is bad so that's my idea because you know Dota 2 development right now um, they are not really focusing, as you could see, f on heroes. Behind the scene, maybe, but not on the release. So, this I think could be in the in the in the realm of possibility that we could switch to the game, see the screen, go back to the picking stage. I think it has to be done because you know if they want to you know focus on this being as real as Dota One was. This is important to me. Right now, for example, I know there's a double dual lane. They are, these are bots, by the way, so, you know, whatever. But there's a dual lane on the top. There's one guy on the bottom, so I would pick support to him. I immediately know that I'm going to bottom, you know. And I feel that's important, so... That is it for today's video. <laughs> Struck me yesterday. I was, like, thinking about it the whole day, like, why it's not there. But if it's there, then please... Please tell me. <laughs> please tell me how to do it. If I say comment, like... Reveal the game command. You can tell me. I I'll appreciate it, but I don't think there's a comment like that. So that's gonna be it for this video. That are gonna be much more important in the future. Uh, videos about 
my feelings about Dota, for example, matchmaking. Um, I feel I need the whole pool and the game to be released, you know, polished, like totally polished. Uh, you know, when they're gonna say the game is up for everybody to grab, that's the time when I want to do the like a review of the important stuff like matchmaking. Right now it's still beta. It is beta. There's limited access. Not everybody can actually join, and not everybody's joining. Like people playing Dota are joining, but I feel the li the, there's definitely limitations of how many people are playing right now. So that is it. Kind of simple video, but I feel it's for me it's important. Even if this is a recharged pick, I want to know the lanes at least so I can adjust. And you know the possibility that comes with the retarded pick, that the people picking are retarded too. <laughs> so, I am the only sane person in the team. I need to see for myself what's going on. So that is it. Please Valve, implement some switch. It's pretty easy. It can be just like a pull bar. Like, I can just like pull the pick stage in the middle of the screen and pull it back. So I can just hover between the picking and the game itself. I think it should be just a layout on top of the game that you could just fucking move. That is it. <laughs> Thank you for watching. I I missed this and I think you should too. That is it.